What's up everybody, Freakenstein here, and today we got New Ages Herbie and Vanishing Point, which is actually uh, Bumblebee and Clip Jumper. So here is the box. We got them both on the front. Look, the legendary heroes. Here is uh, Vanishing Point, Clip Jumper on the bottom. On the top you have the New Age sticker. If you want to, you can uh, take a screenshot of that or whatever. And it's got the Bumblebee. On the other side again, Clip Jumper and Bumblebee. And then on the back you got him just hiding, getting ready to get a blurred out Megatron. So let's open this up and see what we got in the package. So as always, there are instructions. And they shouldn't be hard since they're so small. But here are the instructions for these guys. All right. So we'll put that over there. Stay. Um, we got some bits and pieces in the back here. And of course, we have the two characters themselves. Let's get them out here. So there they are. Aren't they cute? They're just tiny little guys. They're just tiny, tiny little guys. But yeah, there they are. Take a good look. We've got some blue metallic paint. Blue metallic paint. Take a look at him up close. And of course the top and the bottom. Same thing for B. The bottom and the top. So yeah, there they are. So let's uh, compare them to other cars. Oh, wow. That's a big, big difference. And so is that. And so is that. These are all new age characters. So let's just take a, a, a look. Like you can almost fit two of them in one car. I don't know. This is the first time I'm actually uh, saying that new age uh, size is not right. Like, so far, I think they've all been right for size comparison. The cars have all been the same size, and the robot's heights have been almost perfect, if you ask me. So here's some skis. We'll take these skis off. And here is a tire, which I think you can switch... if you want to with that so that's a thing you can do and you can also take that off and if you want to you can also attach the backpack things you can do I'm just gonna leave all these off for now um, now I don't think there's any storage for the weapon on here it doesn't look like there is but that is B's weapon. Um, for the skis, you can take the skis. And they are magnetic. So you can just put them on just like that. So you can have that scene going from the cartoon. Uh, I don't think there's any storage for this gun. But it does come apart there, and I don't know why. Um, but there it is. So, yeah. Things you can do if you want to. So let's just take all this off. Put it to the side. And let's start transforming Bumblebee. So it says to flip this down. Okay. And then all this will flip back. Like that. And then these arms will flip forward. I don't know how well you can see that flip forward. And then all this will come up. Um, you gotta shut these doors. It will come up. Uh, 
Um, I think this has to come all the way up. And then rotate around. Just like that. So now that we have that done. Thing to rotate that down, I believe. Same thing for that side. Rotate that down. All this will come up. Just give me a minute, folks. I believe all this just goes like that. That can't be it. There we go. I believe that's how it goes. And then this piece will rotate in like that. So I believe that's how you want it to look. We can move the arms down, other arms down. So let's just do this one. I'm gonna lift that up so that this can all see if we can get this piece in at the first. There we go. So now that we can rotate all this. Bring that up, close that off. And take that to the back and all this to the front. All right, so uh, there we go. We have Bumblebee all done. Turn his arm around. Fist. But yeah, there, there's B. All done up. Rotate everything to the right way. So yeah, there's a little B head. Not too bad. Not too bad. So uh, we can now give him his back per per portion back. And I'm just going to go with the wheel. I like the wheel. We're going to give that. And then, of course, we can give him his itty bitty gun. It's really small. And we can give that to him. So, uh, there we go. I'm just going to transform this guy real quick. It's the same transformation, and I'll be right back. All right, and we're back. And uh, there they are. Both transformed up. You got B with his little blaster and Cliff Jumper with his. Oh, it's the wrong way. With his big old missile launcher. So there you go. You can get a good look at his head and his chest. All the way down to his feet. Wheel feet. Um, yeah. Not too bad. Not too bad. Let's take a look at Bumblebee. Good old Bumblebee face. I'm just wondering. There we go. So I did have it a little bit wrong, but there we go. Quick fix. There's some beefy feet. Really big beefy feet. Yeah, that's about it for them. So let's take comparison size. So here is a new age sound wave. It looks like a good size to me because all the tapes uh, basically were at his knee height too. And we have Hound. And we have a wheel jack. And just for the fun of it, we have Mech Fans Toys Blaster. Uh, we have um, Rising Force character. Um, 
and an oversized new age Grimlock. And when I mean oversized, he's just slightly bigger. He's just slightly bigger. So and now you've seen them all. Let's get rid of this stuff. Not too bad for size comparison in robot mode. I'm just a little disappointed in the actual uh, vehicle mode, how small they are. But, you know, I like them this size. Like, yeah, that's the size I would imagine them as. So, yeah, I really like these guys. So if you have not subscribed to my channel, make sure that you do. And don't forget to watch the giveaway video that will be coming up soon. And all you have to do is subscribe to be involved nothing else just subscribe and you have the chance to win cool transformer stuff and after i do this giveaway there'll be another one so like always this is freaking science saying keep playing freaking stein